Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. Today I'm headed to Cycle Bar. I was gonna go to Cycle Bar last weekend, but I wasn't able to because of the hair, like the losing the power and stuff. So I had to go back, you know, the other day to get it styled and everything. Um, I was gonna go on Saturday, but then it didn't really work out, but that's fine. I'm just feeling like super out of shape because I haven't like actually gotten a workout in. Um, and I have been low key missing my like video workouts, you know, with, you know, a yoga mat and doing like the Pamela Reef stuff, but I don't know. It's like weird. I don't feel like doing those, but it's like, I miss doing them. Just thoughts for the morning. It's so weird. Like leaving my house when it's daylight because I always leave when it's like pitch black outside. So it is quite funny. Um, but yeah, don't have much planned for this weekend. Uh, probably helping Valerie in the garage and I don't know. We'll see what comes our way. Like most of my friends, like we plan things kind of like sporadically, like just spur of the moment. So we'll see where the weekend takes us. Something's open over here. Whatever this is home. I don't know, but there was no parking. Just super crazy. Shop this brewing joint yeah there was no parking so i had to park like all the way over there <laughs> all right we have a couple of new riders here so i wanted to welcome you okay so spin was good got a good workout in feeling good i always love the feeling after a good workout now i'm going to starbucks and the order ahead is not available which is like tragic um first world problems no but um i guess there's like some outage with like windows microsoft i don't know something so it could be affecting the system because my mom's job like some of their systems aren't working because of it so it's very interesting and i that's my theory of why the order ahead is not available but luckily there's a lot of five minute parking so Gonna quickly go in here and get the coffee. Thank you. Thank you. Of course. And is there anything to ask you guys? Yes, I will be right back. Yeah, with that. well, he already said something. Family dinner. Family dinner. On Friday. Hey. It's the next day, obviously, and we are on our way to Cycle Bar again. It's a glow ride, and I'm happy to get to go twice this week. I think maybe me and my friend are gonna go to the mall after because I wanna shop for a little, like, get together with a friend. Um, so I always said, like, if I have this little get together or meet someone, I wanna go and get and buy an outfit from Aritzia. I mean, yes, I do have pieces from Aritzia, but like, I don't know, like go all in and get like a whole completed look from Aritzia. So that might be happening today. I don't really know. Again, my plans always like just fall at the last minute. So I'm kind of just still waiting to hear back from my friend, Kyra. And I really want to meet her boyfriend. So I hope he says yes. To like going to the mall because I haven't met him and they've been dating for like a while now and I'm like hello when am I gonna meet this dude so like I'm excited and I hope it works out so yeah that's the update for now not really knowing what the future holds other than the cycle bar class okay so I made it to Aritzia and I'm with my friend and her boyfriend so yeah I don't like want to like film in front of him because just because this is like my first time meeting her boyfriend, so I don't want to be doing that. But I found this really cute jumper. I'll get a clip on my phone, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, yeah, in my hair, I just look like a hot mess. Okay, so I'm going to pack my like on-call bag because if I'm out with like a friend or whatever and I get called in, I'm gonna be like wearing something else. I'm gonna be wearing that jumper thing, which is super cute. 
So I'm gonna need like my scrubs and like tennis shoes and stuff. So I'm gonna pack a little bag and just put it in my car so everything's ready. I'm like hoping that I really don't get called in. Like hoping and praying. But you know what, it's my luck if I do. Um, but if I'm prepared, maybe I won't. Fingers crossed. Anyway, so I'm not gonna pack any like compression socks because like I don't want to, <laughs> honestly. I wear that like during the week. I wear like the compression stockings. But I'm just gonna wear, I'm just gonna bring these kids. They're like lightweight and they're still tennis shoes, like closed toed. I wear the shoe booties anyway, so I'm gonna pack those. Also, I need some socks, so I have these all ready to go. And then I have these green scrubs. I brought some home just in case like I'm on call and stuff. So I have this so I could like just change. I could change there. I don't know. I just wanna have, I just wanna have the green scrubs so I could just put this on before I leave. Well, I mean, I'll have it in my bag. I have it in my car so I can just like quickly either change in my car or change when I get there and I just have everything in one bag. And lastly, I need a bra because the jumpsuit, like I'm not gonna wear a bra. So I'm definitely gonna need that. Don't wanna be like going in there with no bra. Funny story, I was interviewing at this hospital and I was wearing this like black dress, the Kate Spade one I got thrifting and they were like, oh, just change into these scrubs so we can give you a tour of the OR and stuff because I hadn't seen it. And yeah, I did not have a bra and I felt super uncomfortable and weird, but it was fine. It didn't last too long. That is what is in my call bag here. It's all ready now. I'm just gonna put it in my car so it's just there and ready to go. And then I'm gonna move all of my other stuff. I switch out bags, not a lot, but back and forth sometimes. This one's kind of getting too small. Like I have a lot of stuff in here, so I have this pouch, which I'm gonna put in there. I have the screwdriver to my bracelet too, in case I get called in and it's in this pouch cause you never know. Um, and then I have like, oh, nothing's really in this, but my hair ties are. I put my hair ties in the back here. I don't even know if this is entertaining for you guys, but I'm always gonna have this on me. Like, no matter where I go in case I get called in. So that lives in my bag. And then this is like my everything. This is like my actual purse that I like grab and go with. That's why I'm debating on getting this like Louis Vuitton one so I can like drop this belt bag. But I don't know. We're still making decisions on what I'm gonna get for my birthday. I don't know. Glasses, hand sanitizer. Um, sunglasses, feminine products, a pen. I always carry floss with me because I get stuff in my teeth. This hoodie thing, so when you're walking in the parking garage, you can pull that if you're getting attacked. And keys, face wipes, and this like random card because I just like stuffed it in there. All right, so we are all good and ready for tomorrow. Ready to go. Yeah, this one's like so much bigger. Well, it doesn't really look like it on the, uh, doesn't really look like it on the camera, but it is in real life. I really want to get the real version of this. This one is from the gate. If you guys know what that means, I don't know. I don't want to say the word because YouTube and like, basically it's not real. <laughs> Let's just say that. Um, I want the real one of this, but the bigger version. So it's bigger than the Neverfull. Yeah, I'm thinking I really want the real one, but they're again expensive and you have to like go to the physical store to get it. So this one's good for now. <laughs> anyway, I think that's gonna be the end of this vlog. I'm just going to do laundry and yeah. So hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog. It was kind of fun, spontaneous. Oh yeah, I met my friend's boyfriend. He's so nice and they are a really good match. Anyway, that was a side note, but give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.